Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel and for today we are going to show you some photos from the Russian Empire. But before we start, I want you to take a look at this picture carefully. Do you know who this man is? Well, find out at the end of this video. Now let's dive in. Zarbel also known as the royal bell, and it is the largest bell in the world, but it has never been rung. Opening State of the Duma The Duma of the First Convocation held one session and lasted 72 days. Admiral Nakimov The third battle cruiser of the Russian Navy's Kirov class. Great Imperial Crown. This was used by the monarchs of Russia and first used by Catherine the Great. Old Believer Woman. Old Believer groups emerge as a result of opposition to the Nikonian reform. Railway Bridge Builders. This is across the Oka River, dated in 1910. Colombian Naval Parade In this picture, Russian boat crews are being towed to races. Railway Bridge Since the 17th century, Murom has become an important handicraft center and the architectural appearance of the historical part of Murom was formed in 19th century. Peasants and a sleigh. Peasants typically made up the majority of the agricultural labor force in the pre industrial society. Jewels of the House of the Romanovs. The executioner of the Romanovs actually attempted to sell these jewelries to the West. Russian cruiser Rinda. It is an armored corvette built for the Russian Emperor's fleet. It is one of the first ships in Russia with a steel body. Diamond Bouquet This also contains emeralds, gold, and silver. Milkmaid Many large houses employed milkmaids instead of having other staff to do the work. Empress Alexandra A close-up picture in her dress and diamond tiara. Sailors of the Russian cruiser Dmitry Donskoy There were more than 10,000 officers, seamen, and marine on board of the 35 vessels of the Colombian fleet. Russian Beauty In the diamond, 25 pearls are attached. This diadem is now owned by the government of the Philippines. Fragments of the Order of St. Andrew This is used to award statesmen, public figures, representatives of various industries for exceptional services and promoting the prosperity of Russia. So, as I mentioned earlier, I'm going to answer the question, do you know who this man is? Well, he is Tsar Nicholas II, the last emperor of all Russia, ruling from November 1, 1894 until his last abdication on March 15, 1917. So what do you think, guys? Did communism benefit the prog progress of Russia? Leave your answers in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching, and if you want to see more of these, then please don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell. See you around!